Okay, we're back from outer space. These are your space cadet relatives. I am space cadet Jaja. I'm space cadet Uncle Fitness. Okay, he's actually space cadet space cadet. Oh no. What? Now, let's review because we have started to learn about the solar system. Last time we learned about four planets in our solar system. Now, can you name the first one that's closest to the sun? Mercury. Mercury, that's right. And what's the next one? Venus. <gasps> Venus. And what's the third rock from the sun? That big old thing right there, Earth. Earth. Actually, that is correct. And what is the fourth planet after Earth? What kind of moon is a planet? No, the moon is not a planet. Dang, the moon is planet. not a planet. Mars. Mars, where the Martians come from. Right. <laughs> All right, so because there are eight planets in our solar system and we already did four, now we have four left. So after Mars comes what? Jupiter. 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 Now. It's big. That's the big monkey planet. See, see, K man, you're talking about monkeys. That's the big monkey planet right there. Right there. And look, what do you see right there? Does that look like a ring? Does that look like a ring? Yeah, it's like stripes. Yeah, those are actually thunderstorms that are happening. What? And this big mm -hmm. one, this is called the red spot yeah. on Jupiter. It doesn't look real red in this picture, but. It shows that. Why are we fading out like this? I don't know. We're the Martians. We're Martians. <laughs> I don't oh, get why we're fading out. Oh, okay. okay, I'll stay right here. Yeah, I'm going to stay. Um, this red spot is what? A huge thunderstorm. And it's always storming. It's always storming. So that's why you guys are lying. He ain't scared of no thunderstorms. Oh, no, you don't know nothing about no storm. No, nothing. That's how you go to Jupiter. Right. As long as you're on Earth, you're okay. Right. right. And that's actually the king of the guys. That's Zeus. That's the big guy with the lightning bolts. That's him. Oh, wait. That's okay. Zeus. Oh, nice. All right. All right. I got you. That's All right. Jupiter. Yep. Now what? Now, Saturn. Look at that one. Now, that one has a bunch of rings around it. All right. But why isn't it? There we go. Okay. Oh, oh. So, it's a gassy planet. It's more gas. It's a planet full of farts. Oh, but it's big. <laughs> and those rings uh -huh. are like dirty snowballs. What? Yeah, it's just all um, like Pumba. Big balls of gas. Wow, and dirty snowballs. And dirty snowballs. It's just oh. that's not the planet you want to be on, by the way. No, but you know this ring looks like it's hard and it's like a hula hoop. There it is. But it's not. It's just made of a whole bunch of dirty snowballs. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. You go right through it. Okay, so we have Jupiter and then we have Saturn. Yes. Jupiter was the one with all the storms. Saturn is the one with the dirty snowball. Ooh. Cool. There it is. Yeah. Saturn. Okay, Jupiter, Saturn. Now what's next? Uranus. Uranus. Now. It's just blue. It I is. can't get a good picture of it. It's blue, but the cool thing is, mm -hmm. if you try to stand on it, uh -huh. it's fall right through because it's right. tilted. Oh, you fall off. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's this one could actually be a really cute earring. Or it could be a really nice necklace. Yeah, you would say that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right. You know, um, yeah. Tell us about Uranus. It's blue. It's blue. And it's blue. Okay. And tilted. And tilted. Yeah. All right. A little boring. A little yeah. boring plan. Yeah. And you know, we're getting further and further away from the sun as we talk about these. So it's getting colder and colder and colder on these planets yeah. as we go. Okay. And the last planet in our solar system. Oh, the last one. Neptune. Oh, ne that sounds familiar. Neptune. Mm, why does that sound familiar? Even here in Virginia Beach, we have a Neptune festival. Why would we have a Neptune festival in Virginia Beach? Water. What? Water. Okay. Because the Roman god Poseidon 
Oh, so him with in the, the pitchfork. It's called Neptune. In Rome, it's called Poseidon. Right. And it's like a giant mermaid with the pitchfork guy. Yeah, that guy down on the. Oh, 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 the little mermaid's dad. Yeah, that guy. That's oh, him. he's called Poseidon in Little Mermaid. And then the other name for him is Neptune. You got it. Yes. Oh, that's yes. cool. Yeah. And you know what? What? The weather is always windy. It is crazy. You go what? flying around. Yep. And see, Leah, it'll blow you. Oh, hell. Yeah. <laughs> I shake my hand, I make it work. I shake my hand, I make it work. It feels like we got the same hair, so it wouldn't do nothing. It no, might just it wouldn't do nothing. But it would blow little man clear <laughs> across the yard. <laughs> He'd be tumbling like a tumbleweed. That would be bad. Yeah. It gets very windy there. Well, I think we finished the solar system. What? I think we did. So, uh, should we do them all? <gasps> oh, this is going to be hard. Okay, I'm gonna, we're going to try to do them all. Yeah. We're gonna, I know Uncle is, is shaking in his boots right now. Okay, I know this is Mercury. This was the first one, the closest to the sun. And Mercury's really, really hot. Yeah. And then next to Mercury, we had... Uh, it's Venus. Venus. <laughs> well, I know it's Venus. I just didn't know which circle to pick up. Okay, so Venus, goddess of love. Venus is close to us, and it's always, always cloudy. Okay, third rock from the sun is Earth, Earth. the place we call home. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, and we know that it's mostly water. We didn't know that before, but now we know Earth is mostly water. Mm -hmm. And then the fourth planet, we'll just start picking up some more, is Mars, mm -hmm. the red planet. You know what we didn't say about Mars? What? Sometimes on a clear, clear night, you can look in the sky and you can see a star that looks kind of red, just a little oh, redder here. Yeah. And it's actually not a star, it's a planet, it's Mars. We can see it standing here on Earth. We can look up in the sky and see Mars. That's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, it's really yeah. crazy. And of course, this is the home for the Martians. This is the home for the Earthlings. This is home for the Martians. Okay, after Mars comes... Jupiter. Jupiter that has all of the stripes. For some reason, Jupiter makes all of the thing go haywire, but Jupiter has all the stripes, which are actually what? Thunderstorms. Oh, they're storms. This is a big storm that never goes away. Right. Like a hickey storm. No. Okay. After that comes Saturn. You can you guys tell me anything that you remember about Saturn? I'll give you a hint. I'm trying to make it safe for me. Oh, it's something special about this ring around Saturn. Yes! Dirty snowball! I'm dirty snowball. <laughs> you guys are listening. <laughs> and then the next is Uranus. And we know that's just little and it's cold and it's lopsided. Tail did eat on fall. Don't try to stand on your right. That's a funny sentence. <laughs> and, <laughs> and then here is the last planet in our solar system, which is Neptune. And that reminds us of Virginia Beach because there is the Neptune Festival and King Neptune, which is the same thing as King Poseidon, the underwater king in The Little Mermaid. That's all named after this. Little Mermaid. That's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Well, you guys are out of this world. You are such wonderful little astronauts. You are all aliens. And you're an alien. So find a good planet and go back home. Goodbye. Peace out.